What's good, photo gang? Welcome back to the channel. I am Jonathan Walker. In today's video, I'm going to give you five tips on your next senior photo shoot. Let's go. So, schools is starting in a couple of weeks. So, you already know what that means. You hear that? It is senior pictures, graduation shoots. It's about to be popping. Some of y'all probably already started, but some of y'all probably haven't started. It might be your first time get into senior photo shoots but it's okay uh i got simple tips that's going to help you with your next shoot or your first shoot so tip number one good vibes uh most of the time in these shoots um this is their first time actually getting a professional uh photographer so most of the time the seniors are going to be nervous they don't know what to expect um their parents forced them to do it so what we have to do is give them good vibes they know if you just there for a check or not so when we first arrive we have to make sure you always got to put a smile on your face make sure it give you that positive energy good energy to the shoot because if you don't they can feel that and that whole shoot is gonna go and we don't want that so good vibes number one number two make sure you scout your location um, prior to the shoot and the reason I said that it is because you don't want to go to no shoot especially a senior photo shoot you don't want to go to no shoot and you have a scout and you're trying to look for locations and spots and the shade are good angles for your client you don't want to do that so a good tip is go there the day before or arrive to the location an hour before the shoot and just look around on different locations so just tell yourself all right i'm gonna put the scene right here sit down i'm gonna put them right here stand it up and just make sure you go try to have a range of different settings in one location if this is your first time doing a senior photo shoot make sure you're trying to get multiple locations a good location to do is downtown like an urban type of environment and another one is, is like a park with like high grass and stuff like that it's always a good easy um, graduation um, photo shoot i'm gonna show you some right now Make sure you scout your location. You got to make sure you scout your location because you don't want to go to a, a location and you don't know what to do. That's unprofessional. We don't want to do that. Bring our A game and that's what we're going to do. Tip number three, Pinterest is your friend. I'm going to say that again. Pinterest is your friend. The reason I said that because you have to learn how to do different poses you got to know different poses so just go to pinterest pinterest has plenty of poses for seniors the thing that i like doing is um i don't really like saving it to pinterest all the time because just in case my uh, wi-fi is messing up or something or my computer, my stuff is messing up so i always like to screenshot it i screenshot it put it on my phone so i probably had like 20 30 different poses different angles that i want i want the um senior to to post like so make sure you go to the day before or week before leading up to session. Just go to Pinterest, look on different ideas for the um, client and make sure you try to have that screenshot or have that on your phone so you won't forget. Cause most times, sometimes you, you might forget um, the poses, but if you got it on a screenshot, you could just look at your phone real quick. Uh, okay, this is what I'm going to do. Uh, the next tip music ask the senior what type of uh music they like it might be hip-hop it might be country it might be r&b you don't know ask them what type of um music they like 
um, playing for your phone or something. Um, so play their station so they can just feel more relaxed, so more up to beat, just feel more in a good mood because they're listening to the music. And the last tip is communication is key. Communication is key. That's the final tip. Make sure, make sure, make sure you make sure, make sure you stay in contact with your client. Do not spend two weeks, three weeks, four weeks and with no communication. You want to make sure you follow up and you want to make sure you just get to know the people. If anything, if they because they go pay some money. If they spend in three, four hundred dollars on a session, make sure if you, if you can FaceTime or you can meet up and discuss the ideas of the shoot and the session and, and see how that goes, because you don't want to uh, meet the client the first time at the session. That's going to be awkward sometimes. So make sure you just FaceTime call, get to know them a little better. So the tips are good vibes make sure make sure you scout your location make sure you scout your location next one is pinterest is your friend okay you gotta thank me later you welcome music make sure you play some music get that good vibes good vibes good vibes and last communication let's talk to the client they're going to spend some money okay they're going to spend some money so make sure this is the best experience that you can give them because it could be future clients um, down the line you never know so make sure you do good let me know in the comments how was your first senior shoot or have you ever did one um, i hope you like the tips and until next time i'm jonathan walker Peace out, photo game.